Sample problem 9.01. Three particles of masses M1, which is equal to 1.2 kilogram, M2, which is equal to 2.5 kilogram, and M3, which is equal to 3.4 kilogram, form an equilateral triangle of edge length A equal to 140 centimeter. What is the center of mass of this system? So here they gave the chart and they mentioned the particles 1, 2, 3, which is kept at the location. You can see the graph. M1 is exactly kept at origin and M2 is here and M3 is here. And also they gave the masses of each particle. The M1 takes the value of 1.2 and 2 is 2.5 and M3 is 3.4. And also its respective coordinate system is given that is x1 comma y1. That means the location of m1 is 0 comma 0 and the location of m2 is 140 comma 0 and the value the location of m3 coordinate x3 comma y3 is 70 comma 120. So that means here I can just write these are all the masses which is m1, this is m2 and this is m3. And the value of x1, this is y1, this will be x2, this is y2, this is x3, and this is y3. So simple thing, we have to substitute the values in the center of mass rule. So what is the rule for the center of mass? As we already studied the rule for finding the x center of mass, x center of mass, which is equal to m1 x1 plus m2 x2 plus m3 x3 divided by m1 plus m2 plus m3 which is equal to i'm going to substitute the value m1 value is 1.2 multiplied by x1 value here is 0 plus m2 value is 2.5 multiply and the x2 value is 140 plus m3 value here is 3.4 and the value of x3 here is 70 divided by m1 which is 1.2 plus 2.5 plus 3.4 so here we have to find the answer one by one so 1.2 multiplied by 0 is 0. So 0 plus 2.5 multiply 140. We got 350 plus 3.4 multiplied with 70. We got 238 it's divided by M1 plus M2 plus M3, which is 1.2 plus 2.5 plus 3.4 the answer for this is 7.1 so now we have to find the answer so 350 plus 238 divided by 7.1 i got the answer here as 82.82 or we can just 82.82 and its unit is in centimeter because all these values are in centimeter they clearly mentioned the unit here is in centimeter so better we can round it the value to the closer number so 82.82 we can just round it to 83 centimeter so which is our x center of mass so likewise we have to find the value of y center of mass y center of mass which is equal to m1 y1 plus m2 y2 plus m3 y3 so divided by m1 plus m2 plus m3 now i'm going to substitute the values here so let's we just have a look of the chart so these are all the values so y1 is 0 y2 is 0 and y3 is 120 so here m1 m2 m3 is okay so the value of y1 and y2 is 0 so it's very easy we can directly substitute the value so the m1 value is 1.2 or i can write it here 1.2 multiplied by 0 plus 2.5 multiplied by 0 plus 3.4 multiplied by 120 divided by 
1.2 plus 2.5 plus 3.4. So here this 2 will give 0. So 0 plus 0 plus 3.4 multiply 120. The answer is 408. 408 divided by. So when you add all these things, we got 7.1. So which is equal to 408 divided by 7.1. We got 57.5, 57.46 we got, so we got 57.46, that means 57.5 centimeter. So if you rounded the value, your Y center of mass, which is equal to uh, 58 centimeter. So this is the answer. And also you can just go back to the, the graph. They clearly fix this point. You can see the X value here is 83 and Y3, Y center of mass is uh, so you can see here your x value here is closer to 83 and your y value is closer to 58. So we fix the point here. So this is the answer for this question. That's it. Thank you.